I don't want to go, Dennis, Jake. They put you in a hole filled with snakes and rotten butter and they leave you there. Whoa! Fudge, man! This place is Yoga Balls huge! JJ Flip! What the zip? Can I have my backpack back? Pack? What are you doing with that egg? Come on, guys. Who wants to hear this kind of canned crap? Stain, maybe? <laughs> are you kidding me? Do I really come off as a leader? I'd have more freedom down in the lower ranks. Somewhere in the 20s. I know, I'm awful, right? But like I said, I have no self-control. That's... That's amazing. This is the perfect time to recruit more sinners for the hotel! Oh, Buster, I think he's had enough! Ugh, why is this so hard? What am I doing wrong? But that's so mean! Hello? Sorry, I didn't think anyone lived up here. I'm going to pretend I didn't see that. How do you know who I am? What the hell was that? Wait, that was only part of the story! I, I know how it sounds, but what I've told you is the truth. Cybugs will chew up that game faster than a chicken hawk in a coop of crippled roosters. Viruses do not stop! Once those cybugs finish off Sugar Rush, they'll invade every other game until this arcade is nothing but a smoking husk of forgotten dreams. Can it fix it? Impossible. Nothing gets past me. It's not so glamorous, but this is what it takes to be a star. Usually, like, it'd be about murder. They're a bunch of, like, middle-aged dads, and uh, their kids go missing in, like, this fantasy world. The whole podcast is these, these old men trying to get their kids back. Bury me six feet in snow. I like to draw. Um, here. My diamond allows me to draw during court proceedings. Pink diamond. My diamond has requested your presence. Welcome back, and the lustrous blue diamond. It's mine, of that there's no doubt. My late wife and I had them made to celebrate our betrothal. This man, what has he said, Inspector? Did he ever tell you that I gave him the ring? Stop it, both of you! That is quite enough! Son, I know that boys your age are prone to fisticuffs. However, Jojo, I saw you pummel Dio mercilessly after the point at which he had obviously no chance of winning the fight. Please, see that he's buried next to Dario. All right, Joey. I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. Oh my god. Joey, what were you doing? Sorry I had to do that. Nice hat, though. Don't be scared, Boris. I'll keep the light near you so you don't get lost. Boris! No, no, what has she done to you? I was cursed, cursed with these spaghetti arms! <laughs> Gora! Oh, for a moment there, I thought it was your mom. Now we need a performance from you, Torpedo Boy! <laughs> but Dynamite and Heavy Machinery are marvelous problem solvers. A old sport! You beat me, Jojo. And as a warrior, it would now appear that you stand taller than I do. Although sworn to Lord Cars, I will not allow the vampires to attack you. It's not because of sentiment. I told Caesar this as well. Where is he, that infuriating smart-talking upstart? I hear tell that Jojo has learned quite a bit. I see the world has undergone significant changes during my slumber. These insignificant inventions must be quite popular here. Actually, yes. But only because you signed your notes. Every page, I might add. A little egotistical, don't you think? A poor cripple from the Undercity. I was an outsider the moment I stepped foot in Piltover. Oh, I... Yeah, I, I, I meant to tell you. Uh, a headache. I just... I need to get to the lab. Damn your eyes, you lazy boy! Are you deaf? Listen, dear. I am not long for this world. When I die, <coughs> you get yourself to the Joestar <coughs> mansion along with this letter. Uh, you stay back! What do you want? I thought punching was supposed to be like, the one thing you're good at. If your bots can't dig it out, then maybe I'll send you down. Cap so, here's the thing. I've done this. The whole threatening people bit, the intimidation. I've been there, and I just don't care anymore. My face! My face! My face! Give me back my eyes! Ah! On your marks, get set, go! You think you're better than me? In the future, you will address me as captain or ma'am. Is that clear? Gentlemen, this must be kept under lock and key when not in use. 
And Doctor, again, with the greatest possible respect, zip your howling screamer. I don't much care for this crew you hired. They're... How did I describe them? I don't know. I said something rather good this morning before coffee. You can do what you want with me. I won't be a part of this, this, this evil any longer. Oh, please, Professor. Yes, yes, I'll, I'll finish it. Oh, just don't hurt my daughter. Ah, but uh, I haven't given you your present yet. Crash, Coco, remember, it is not only Dr. Cortex that we battle. Beware of Uka Uka, my children. He is a far more dangerous enemy than anyone can imagine. Uka Uka is free. No, it cannot be. Evil, great evil has come. Did I ever tell you how I got the nickname, the Dragon of the West? It's more of a demonstration, really. Only once every hundred years can a firebender experience this kind of power. What, are you crazy? Lightning is very dangerous. Even in exile, my nephew is more honorable than you. You must stay here where you're safe. Do you understand, Flower? I'm not getting any younger down here. You know what I see? I see a strong, confident, beautiful young lady. The world is dark and selfish and cruel. You want me to be the bad guy? Fine. Now I'm the bad guy. It's like a group of couples agreeing to do ecstasy together. It's the case of the empty wallet and the for some reason bleeding knee. As they say in the movie Jerry Maguire, you had me at AIDS. I'm new in town and it gets worse. Last it, moronic sentimental trash! Say your goodbyes to that arrow! Once I've sent you back to the depths of hell, you'll have no further need for it! You impudent wretch! Such tedious bills, all for some girl! You'll rot in hell, you Philistine mounds of excrement! I'll be sure to send all of you there myself! Stay away! Leave me alone! I'm afraid it is. He's not here at the moment, um, but you're welcome to come in and wait. Oh my! You poor dear! You must be chilled to the bone! Mr. Battle! <laughs> How many times? Now, there's nothing to be afraid of, my dear. Yo, what's up? Oh, man, that's beautiful. Grass grows, birds fly, sun shines, and brother, I hurt people. I'm a force of nature. Boom! <laughs> hey, knucklehead, you ain't gonna win. Only dull people think things are dull. Sounds stressful. Am I? Uh, I don't think I am. What about us? Does it... What does it say about me? Am I dead? No. No, I'm not, I'm not comfortable with that. What's this? How many times do I have to keep teaching you this lesson? Hmm. You should really have a doctor take a look at that. That's the wrong answer. Quit screwing around and get serious. Now tell me what I said from the beginning. Oh boy, he's cracked. He's gone nuts. You got a problem, Pinky? <laughs> oh, to think we gotta keep kissing up to that chump and his chump daughter for the rest of our lives.